I'm trying to think. So I think I first, okay, I first knew that like software engineering and like um, like computer science was a thing. When I was in high school, I saw a flyer for uh, like a nearby university that was like had all these people jumping and they were like, you can be a software engineer, like you can be in computer science. And I was like, I don't know what that is. My mom was like, you should check this out. It's like, okay, I don't know. Um, but in, in, uh, in high school, I was, I was like set on being an English major. I was gonna, I don't know what I was gonna do, but I was like English, it's like, that's what I'm gonna do. And then I happened to take like a, an Oracle databases class. And I like got it, I think I like got like the certificate, like you, you've done it, you're like certified as like an Oracle like database person. Um, but it was really, f it was like kind of fun and I was like, I kind of like this. So they had another, one other class um, at my high school and it was like, uh, it was like HTML, something, something, like building websites and it all, they also had some flash in there too. So I took that and it was like, that was really fun. And this was also kind of during the time of like personal like blogs and stuff. So you could kind of like make your own and add HTML and like, so it was kind of fun. Um, and so then by the time it was like kind of just time to decide like what I wanted to do, like what was my major? I was like, oh, I guess I'll try like computer science and like see what that's about. Um, and I did, and it was really hard. I mean, I, I had like absolutely no like idea what I was getting into. Um, but yeah, I like, you know, went through college and kind of like made it through. Um, and this is in, <laughs> this is in Idaho. So, uh, so in the US, if, if you don't know where Idaho is, there's like California, Oregon, Washington on, on the West Coast. And then right next to like Oregon and Washington um, is Idaho. So there's not a lot going on in Idaho. Uh, it's like it's like a national forest. There's like a lot of it, and, and it's like fairly rural in places. Um, so anyway, so not all the people know about Idaho. And in college, even um, I didn't know that like the Bay Area was a thing. I you know I didn't know where I was going to be working. Um, so I kind of heard about it because a friend of mine got an internship at Pager Duty. And he was like, this is awesome, you need to come and visit. And we're like, okay, so we came to San Francisco, you know, I came to San Francisco and like saw what this was about. I was like, I could live here, like this is pretty cool. And then that same friend got like, like randomly he met someone and they worked at Twitter and like, you should apply. So he applied and got a job at Twitter. And we, everyone in Idaho was just like, oh my gosh, tell us all about it. And he like, we were in the room, he got the phone call and he was like, I got the job. And we're like, oh, this is like crazy. Um, so he. We, we just like, this was like unimaginable for like Idaho. It was just kind of like, this was so weird. Um, so he got this job at Twitter and like, oh my gosh, like everyone's like, we could all do this. We could go to like, you know, the Bay Area, we could go to San Francisco and we could like do this. Um, so yeah, so then um, basically I applied for jobs here um, and I got a, a job at like a really small startup called <laughs> Munchery um, and they did like food delivery um, and made it by chefs on site. and. That was like my first job in San Francisco. So then I moved here and uh, started working there. And that was really cool. And then I got another job at a different place called Vungle. They did like video, uh, mobile visit, video advertising. Um, and then from there, uh, basically kind of getting more into the like kind of, you know, software engineering community and kind of going to meetups. I ended up going to a meetup. Um, it was kind of like a tech talk thing at Medium. And uh, it was it had a bunch of really cool uh, women engineers who were working on like an iPad app, um, and I was like, this is so awesome. So, uh, kind of after that, I was like, I should I should work at Medium. This is really cool. And so I ended up applying, and yeah, got got a job at Medium, and it was just really cool being a part of that because that was kind of like the other companies I had been at. It was you know sort of kind of getting into like software engineering and kind of like understanding it. And then Medium felt like my first real like, okay, like I definitely know what I'm doing now. Um, and kind of being there and that was uh, my kind of first uh, start into like tech leading and kind of like understanding how that works. And then with uh, GraphQL, just like hearing about it um, and then kind of like working on different projects and kind of like moving things along. And then uh, yeah, through, through Medium, I was kind of like in GraphQL, uh, kind of learning about GraphQL and like, oh, Twitter uses GraphQL, we're using Scala, like they use Scala and kind of like hearing about that. And I ended up talking to Twitter people and I was like, this place looks awesome also. Um, so yeah, so talking to people and uh, ended up working here. But it's been a, it's been a very strange journey uh, getting, getting here, but it's been, it's been cool. <laughs>